I want to advise my brothers from Western. There are these two tumbocrats, namely Mudavadi and Wetangula. Won't take you anywhere. Pamoja na wabunge wote. Mr. Speaker, nataka kuwa kifupi kama mkia wambuzi. Na nikianzia hii vita ya Western Region. I want to advise my brothers from Western. Kindly try to avoid these political businessmen as a plague. There are these two tumbocrats, namely Mudavadi and Wetangula. I'm telling you as early as at now that these two people won't take you anywhere. Mudavadi has been in the government for 40 years. He has nothing to point. Wetangula has been in the government for 30 years. He can't point anything. As at now is the third in command of this great nation of Kenya, the speaker, he has done nothing. We know that speaker has no allocations to develop his region, but he has some appointments. He has nobody he has placed in speaker's panel. So... <laughs> thank you very much. Member, Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and you'll give me an additional minutes of five. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I'm, con I'm done with that issue of Western region. And now allow me to touch on Nyanza. There are some political rumors and some political failures who are talking behind the curtains of who will inherit Raila's position. Now let me tell you this as at now. Even Raila himself got that position by himself. Nobody fought for him to be our kingpin. Nobody gave him that very position. For my brothers and sisters who are politically able to take this position only and only if, Mr. Speaker, only and only if Rahil has declared that he's going for political retirement. But if not, the enigma is still the sixth. Mr. Speaker, I want to support a statement which was said by a colleague here, that some of our youthful leaders are saying that uongozi haupeanwi, uongozi uchukuliwa. And my brother Babu Owino, I want to stand firm with you. I want to stand bold with you that if you have all the political strengths to take it, nyakua. Babu nyakua subui na mapema. Wazee wamekua hawajafanya chochote lakini nawe umeingia siasa hizi majuzi lakini mambo ambayo umeyatenda yanaonekana sasa hivi nyangarika ambao wanakuja ati wao ndio wazee wako na experience there's nothing like political experience and if there was something like political experience enigma would have served this great nation for more than 30 years so mr babu wino wake up and i know you've never slept kindly come out as early as at now Take your position. If you can challenge them, the old goons, challenge them. Mr. Speaker, I conclude because I had many interferences. The issue of alcohol battle in, in Kenya in general, and to be precise, central region. I want to advise Mr. Rigiji, fight only the illicit brews and all the legal brews. Don't dare try. Because these are very people who pay tax for this nation. These people feed their children and families through these brews. These people have legal businesses. So if you want to dare try to, to close these businesses, Mr. Arigiji, you are going the wrong direction. As I conclude, Mr. Speaker, because the next speaker is not on the floor, I'm advising Mr. Arigiji, if you are not keen, you are politically dying. Wake up from your sleep. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.